Guys, it's finally that month. August, the month of the anniversary. Unfortunately, the anniversary sync pairs do not come in the August update. They come in the September update. And one more thing is that DNA sneakily decided not to release the entire August update. So we are still no idea whatsoever of the real bait units, the shaft units, the ones that are gonna steal all our gems because they're coming on August 14 or something. But with that in mind, guys, how many gems are we getting for the first half of August? In this video, we discuss that. So hit the thumbs up as it really helps the channel. Comment your thoughts, subscribe if you haven't. And if you're generous, you can become a member or leave a super thanks, super chat. But with that said, let's do this. Here we go. Yo, 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 this is Sol, also known as SPL Gum, also known as Spatial Gum, also known as Grunt, the artist Team Skull Grunt, and this is Pokemon Masters EX. Guys, in this video, we are going to discuss how many gems we can get from the August data mine, or the data mine that we receive, or the update that we received today. As you might know, it's incomplete, and DNA is gonna release the second half of the August update somewhere close to August 14. But this video took quite a while to do because, well, number one, I had to teach class somewhere far, far away. It kind of hit my busiest day, one of my busiest days, which is Wednesday. And one more thing is that I cannot find this image anywhere. I confirmed with two data miners, asked them if they have found an image to the extreme battle event they said no, or at least one of them said no, and I had to edit that image by myself, look, make it look as authentic as possible. So it took a while, a while, it took more than 30 minutes to do. So I would appreciate all the love and support and stuff and stuff. You know your thing, guys. But now let's move on to the gem count. All right, in this update, we have quite some not too many but not too few events as well we have the villain event team magma's red hot rage we're probably in the second half we will get team aqua's blue cold i don't know clamor whatsoever we have the main story villain arc for hoenn we have the extreme battle event that i'm proud of that image because i had spent so much time to do that we have the solo event team hoenn unite we have a fire and ground type egg event and we have blissful bonanza as well as a little bit more but we're not yet done with this month so let's discuss this gem count i'm gonna clarify this right now it's gonna begin from august tw uh, july 28 that's tomorrow until august 14. july 28 to August 14 and I want to you know I haven't exactly finished all the missions of the special rally yet but just for the sake of those who have finished I'm going to imagine or I'm gonna assume that everyone has already finished their missions for special rally and you have already gotten your 900 gems from this thing by using 2,500 stamina, so you probably will not receive anything here. Or probably you will, because I haven't finished Special Rally yet. So add at least 500 gems for finishing all the missions. So you just add 500 gems from your fine to your final gem count. But keep in mind that I'm assuming that you have finished this already, guys. Next, we have Blissful Bonanza happening currently until July 31. We don't have any special bliss battles yet, so we're gonna have two special bliss battles coming. And then we still have four days of daily bliss battles. The earliest you can finish all the missions is tomorrow, I think. So that's your 300 gem things. And 400 plus 200 plus 300 equals 900 gems. Still have 900 gems from Blissful Bonanza, guys. And one last thing, 
is the special login bonuses. From July 8th or 28th to July 31, you can get 200 gems from locking it daily. From finishing your daily missions, you can get 320 gems. And from going to purchase gems, getting your gift gems, you can get 80 gems for a total of 600 gems from the special login bonuses and daily missions. And if you add these all up, the end of the month or from July 28th to the end of July, you can still get 1,500 gems plus 500 if you haven't finished all the missions for your um, special rally. So 1,5 to 2,000 to so on and so forth. But that's the end. That's for this month. And now let's move on to the next month, which are these things. Well, not really next month. Some happen this month like the villain event team magma's red hot rage starts on july 29 ends on august 27 as you might know july 29 is the release date of cygna suit may and july 31 is the release date of cygna suit brendan and you might be wondering yes it's a sunday they're releasing a sync pair on sunday like what the heck i like it better than releasing on saturday still so there's team Challenge Team Magma Part 1, 2, and 3 gives you 30 gems each. Daily Extreme Battle 1, and then there's two battle challenges, plus missions which give you 700 gems for a total of 1,020 gems from the villain event Team Magma's Red Hot Rage. And you can scout for Courtney later on as a Spotlight Scout. And for those who are wondering, um, yes, Spotlight Scouts follow Aaron, Bertha, Lucian, where you can go the paid route and guarantee yourself one copy, at least one copy of the Spotlight Scout units. So that's a plus, but then those are bait units because anniversary is coming, guys. Number two, we got the villain Ark Hoenn starts on July 29th. And the, it, it's probably the first half of the Hoenn villain arc. 50 gems for um, finishing the stories. Then there's Challenge Team Magma, Part 1 and Part 2, as well as Team Challenge Team Aqua, Part 1 and 2. 30 gems each for a total of 120 gems from both Challenge Team Magma and Team Aqua for a total of 170 gems from the main story villain arc, Hoenn. Next, we got this thing that I spent so much time working on. Extreme Battle Event Battle Hoenn's Best is a difficult, difficult challenge where Zinnia and uh, Wally are going to be destroying everyone's teams and giving everyone emotional damage. Unless you decide to scout on the uh, Cygnus Suit May and Cygnus Suit, um, whatchamacallit, Brendan, which is probably gonna give you an easier time finishing these stages. 300 gems for each battle, for each part. And by finishing all stages, you can get 1,200 gems from this extreme battle event. Now we have the rerun of the solo event Team Hoenn Unite. I don't think I need to emphasize this. This is, this is run quite a couple of of months a year or something ago and you can get 940 gems from finishing the solo event team hoenn unite next we got the fire and ground type egg event and i'm curious right now guys have you hatched a shiny tyrogue i have hatched a shiny tyrogue again earlier um i have gotten Shiny Hitmon Lee, I have gotten Shiny Hitmon Tap. I still do not have a Shiny Hitmon Chan. That's the only thing I'm missing. And I hatch a striker earlier. That means it's a Shiny Hitmon Lee again. I'm just worried I want all three shinies. And um, it's a three week event. No normally, an uh, egg event is two weeks. The Tyro thing is three weeks. So that's, that's a plus, I guess. But Egg events give you 120 gems. Let me know who you scouted or if you're able to hatch a shiny Tyro and which role you're able to hatch, guys. Next, we have Blissful Bonanza happening on August 8th and on August 14th. 
And that's one week of Blissful Bonanza. Again, one week is equivalent to 1,200 gems, plus a lot of those um, cookies and stuff. And you might be wondering, guys, if you have already updated your game, um, Legendary Gauntlet disappeared. Yes, they actually announced it. And Legendary Gauntlet is gonna be back probably in the next update, but they decided to remove it. And um, if you have gained some rewards, you can get rewards again by finishing Legendary Gauntlet again. So that's a good thing. And then we are done. <laughs> Those are the six events. There's more, but let us recap everything first. Villain event, Team Magma's Red Hot Rage gives you 1,020 gems. Main story, Villain Arc, Hoenn gives you 170 gems. Extreme Battle event, Battle Hoenn's Best gives you 1,200 gems. Solo event, Team Hoenn Unite gives you 940 gems. Fire and Egg or Fire and Ground type Egg event gives you 120 gems. And Blissful Bonanza gives you 1,200 gems. And add these all up, and you can get 4,650 gems. Very low. <laughs> very low! Very low, guys. Let's move on. We still have Battle Villa happening on August 8th as well. Ends on August 21. Finish all the halls, you get 2,000 gems. Next. We have the rerun of Legendary Arena Cobalion. This time, it happens on August 5 and ends on August 18. You need to use 3 Hoenn Sing Pairs, 3 Fire Type Sing Pairs, and 3 main characters to get 1,000 gems from finishing all the event missions for Legendary Arena Cobalion. We also have a special rally happening on August 8, ends on August 14. And 900 gems for getting or for using 2,500 stamina. This is an addition. You know, we're we're having a special rally right now. We're having another special rally. That's good. 900 gems. And last but not the least, we have the special login bonuses. Which we only have one right now. Team Magma's Red Hot Rage login bonus. Gives you 1,000 gems for logging in for days 2 to 4, 6 to 8, 10 to 13. Finish all your daily missions, you get 1,120 gems. Daily login bonuses, he gives you 900 gems. Again, this is from August 1 to August 14. And by going to the purchase gem screen to get your gift gems, you can get 780 gems. And if you add these all up, you can get 3,800 gems from the special login bonuses. And so, and so guys, moment of truth. Battle Villa gives you 2,000. Cobalion gives you 1,000. Special Rally gives you 900. Special Login Bonuses gives you 3,800 gems. Moment of Truth, guys. 7,700 gems. Add these up to the earlier count. And you get a measly... 12,350 gems, like what the heck? That is a very, very low count. But then you gotta remember again, guys, that this is only, only for August 1 to August 14. And there's still the second half of the month, which might double this number. And also, you know, the second half of the month is the run up to three point, or three year rally, run up to three, your anniversary rally something normally they gave they give away a huge chunk of gems once the run up happens but then be better take note that we are going to have some a lot of bait units happen beware beware but then don't forget that we also got 1500 gems from this month which is possible to get 2000 gems if you do not if you haven't finished your special rally missions yet. So if we add this up, I'm imagining or assuming you get 1,500, you can get a total of 13,850 gems from this one. 13,850. That's all you get, guys. That is all you get. Sad, right? What do you think? What do you think? 
And yes, for those who are smart, yes, I haven't forgotten. We have this. We have the Hoenn Villain Retweet Rally. For a chance, or for a guaranteed chance, guaranteed chance, to get 6,000 gems with 30,000 retweets. And if we add that up to our number earlier, we get, we get a grand total of 19,850 gems from this update. And that's the end, guys. I hope you like this gem count video. Don't forget again to hit the thumbs up. It's a small thing, but it really helps the channel out. Let me know your thoughts if this is enough for the first half at least of the month. Remember, first half we're getting four sync pairs already. We get two poke pairs, two spotlights. Um, I'd, I'd argue that Courtney is actually a little bit better than the poke pairs. I don't know. Uh, for me, at least. Courtney is uh, the good thing about her is she's spotlight, but then Courtney Luker finally long awaited another poison type. Then we got Cygnus with May, Cygnus with Brendan. And you know, if you get shafted, that's 36,600 gems plus it's the anniversary, and we still do not know who is the second half, who the bait units are in the second half. Ha! <sighs> Let me know what you think, guys. But that's our gem count. And if you're curious about my analysis for those sync pairs, you can check out my August sync pairs who to scout for a video. It's probably gonna come tomorrow late or something. I don't know because I have to wake up very early tomorrow to teach or to attend yoga classes with my teacher. Ha! Huh? And with that said, I would like to give a very huge shout out to all my members who have been supporting me. These are the gifted memberships which have been gifted by Shadow Phil, Jeremy, and Tatsuya Gold. Everyone who's part of this list, you are a member of this channel. Welcome and hope you're active in this channel. But to my members who have been supporting me for the very long, for the longest time, thank you so much, Shadow Phil. Thank you, Marokman. Also, thank you, Marokman, for the super thanks that you have been giving my gem count videos. Really appreciate it. Thank you, Aryan Singh. Thank you, Tacman. Thank you, Alsin, Roy, Luca, Jeremy, Sasri Ambreon, Marcella, Lance Knife, Iwis, and Tatsuya Gold. Thank you, everyone, for your support. I just updated my membership video. If you are dis if you are interested and want to support the channel financially, you can become a member of my channel, get shoutouts like these guys, and have a cute, spiffy, cool Pokeball icon badge, whatsoever you want to call it, beside your name, plus get to play with emojis of the upcoming sync pairs that are, you know, in chat and in the comments section. But with that said, that concludes my gem count video for the first half of August. I hope you like it. With that said, this is Sol, also known as SPL Gum, also known as Spatial Gum, also known as Grunt. The artist team is called Grunt. I will see you in the next video. Right.